Welcome to Manitoba Bushcrafting and Reviews. I'm Alex. I just wanted to post a quick video today uh, asking you guys a question. Would, what would you prefer to see next uh, reviewed? I'm thinking either I uh, sell my ILBE because it is it's bulky and uh, hard to maneuver through the woods with it. And I'm thinking about maybe downsizing my pack sell this one, get what I can out of it, which on eBay they're going from anywhere from $200 all the way up to $500 depending on condition. And this thing's in pretty decent condition because uh, I traded my old one in for a new one and it had never been used and I've been very gentle on it. So I'm thinking about maybe trading this pack in and getting a mystery ranch pack. Uh, a three day assault pack maybe, something like that. I would love to have the over overload pack, but that uh, that's like $1,500 Canadian, so that's way out of my budget. Way, 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 way out. Even the assault pack is pretty far out of my budget. Um, but uh, if I sell this pack and the uh, USGI big puff suit, I should be able to get enough that I could afford the assault pack, downsize my kit, so I can maneuver through the woods easier, uh, just maneuver in general easier, and uh, that way it's not like all camouflage and stuff like that, so I can take it into town and not look silly. Um, so uh, if you guys got any recommendations out there that I haven't, sorry, that I haven't uh, noticed yet online, uh, shoot me a message in the comments or whatnot, and I'll, I'll at least consider it. Um, but right now I'm thinking of either the three-day assault pack by Mystery Ranch or the Komodo Dragon. And I'm oh, pretty sure the 2019 models don't have on either pack uh, um, compression straps on the bottom for attaching a sleep system. Which is something I definitely need if I have a smaller pack. I'm not going to be able to fit my sleep system in it. It's going to have to go on the outside. And uh, yeah... I got some videos coming up, some small videos on uh, little pieces of gear that I, I've been trying to get my hands on for a while, but they were quite expensive and finally I got a deal on them. So those are coming in and expect a review and uh, probably in the same video as the review, I'm going to uh, show you how to tell the difference between a fake and a legit piece of the mystery item that I'm going to be reviewing in probably a few days here. So keep an eye out for that video and uh, just going for a stroll right now through the woods around my house and uh, yeah it's a nice day out so enjoying the day outside anyhow if you like this video click like if you want to share hit share if you want to comment down below please do so and definitely subscribe for upcoming videos on military surplus or camping gear or uh, companies that make military grade packs and tents and pretty much anything that you'd need to go out in the wilderness. Anyhow, see you guys later. Bye.